Rangers and welcome to Ranger Review YouTube channel. Today in this video, I will be going over how to find national parks near you. Let's go ahead and dive right on in. Okay now, so the only thing you will really need in order to find national parks near you is access to the internet. And if you're watching this video, I think you have access to the internet. So let's go ahead and go on to other Ranger Ruby to explain how to find national parks near you via online resources. Okay, hello guys. Thank you other Ranger Ruby for introducing this video. As she said earlier today, we are going to go over how to find national parks near you. There are many ways you can go about this, but in this video we are going to say three. Um, two online and then the other one Ranger Ruby will say at the end of this video. So let's go ahead and dive on into some of the park sites you can go to. The first one is literally a site that's made to help you find national parks near you. www findyourpark.com and instead of waiting this to load I already handy dandily got this done so what this does is it gets you this website which is basically solely meant for you to find national parks you can choose an activity or just select a state why don't we say select close that Kansas just for now and then we will search that it loads and then good news you're one step closer and then it shows you a bunch of parks and activities that you can find in kansas if that's where you live and that's one way to help you find national parks in your state or in any state you're going to visit but of course we can't just give you one way to find one the next site is the national park services homepage, which is www.nps.gov and then once you're here, it shows you a bunch of cool stuff about the National Park Service. But the one thing that we want to show you today is this. This little bar right here, all you have to do is pull that down, and then it has a list of all the states. And not just that, it got, got like the Virgin Islands, and if you go up here to the letter G, it's got Guam, so it's got all the states and U.S. territories. Mm -hmm. Let's just pick one, like Georgia. And then once you click a state, it will, once this loads, give you a map of the state and where all the little towns are and parks are. And then it'll give you a full list of each national park with a little summary of it right here. Oh, a little picture. It'll tell you what type of park it is here. It will also tell you where the park is located. Then if you click this link here, it will take you to the park's site. This one I happened to pick was Jimmy Carter National Historic Site. And so if you live in Georgia and you're interested in visiting that, here you go. Um, if you would like to know how to navigate a park's official website, check out the video in the card. I will link to it up there so you can check it out on how, you know, you find all the details in this awesome website that the National Park Service has set up for you. Well, everybody, let's go on to other Ranger Ruby as she gives us one more way that you can find national parks near you. Okay here's just one more way if you don't really have access to the internet, which uh, you're watching this video, but I'm going ahead and going to tell this to you. At most national parks, there is this map. This is a map of all of the national parks. And if you don't actually have this map, there are still some other ways you can do it. You can do it with a road atlas, like this one. This one's huge and I haven't seen you since the Christmas video, link in the card. But this atlas is a 2018 road atlas, and a lot of you have it in your house or in your car. If not, you might have something a bit smaller like this, though, well, not the 2011 edition. Maybe something a little bit more updated. But all of these are very easy. You just flip to a state, and I guarantee you it will have the national parks. This is Nevada, and there it is. There are a couple of national historic sites, national historic. There is Death Valley, that's somewhat in Nevada, and so most road atlases will have national parks in them if you do not have online resources, which again, if you're watching this video. Well everybody, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and comment down below any national parks you have visited. Also be sure to click the red subscribe button and the little bell next to it to always know when I post a new video. Thanks so much for watching and I shall see you in another video. Bye!